Ja, hallo und äh, herzlich willkommen zurück bei 400 Days, 400 Tage und heute widmen wir uns der Geschichte von Shell. Oder Shell oder Shell. Mal genau hinhören. Alles beginnt oder endet bei Gills Pitstop, scheinbar. Apokalypse-Lied von Shell, Tag 236. Hey Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Ja, Kinder wollen auch nicht immer vor allem bewahrt werden, ne? Aber in der Apokalypse ist es wahrscheinlich besser so. Becca, so. that was great! Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? Natürlich können wir das jede, Mal, uh, jede Woche machen. That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. Actually, I wanted to make sure our blades were in good condition first. No rush on the flashlights. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Watch Dogs. Okay, Shell hilft hinten. Wir steuern, steuern auf jeden Fall nicht. Oder doch? Ist es jetzt Shell? Ich glaube schon. Ja, vielleicht ist es aber auch nicht gut, die Kleine vor allem zu bewahren, weil, wie wir schon bei Lee und äh, Clementine gesehen haben, ähm, sollten die Kinder sich wenigstens verteidigen können. Ich, these knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. Okay, auf der Liste zum Schärfen oder was? How we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. Das ist doch gut. What? Nothing. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Okay, also Wachhunde füttern. Ja, was war das? Was ist da hinten an der Wand noch? The diner looked pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also not as many dead visitors back then. Guck mal, wenn jetzt die Apokalypse wirklich erst vor 180 Tagen gestartet ist, und das sieht alles so aus, als wäre das schon jahrzehntelang runtergekommen, also vielleicht ein bisschen, äh, ein bisschen übertrieben. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done.
Ah, da geht's durch. Hey Becca, think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh yeah, then we can spend all our money at nowhere. <lacht> genau, das ganze Geld im Niemandsland ausgeben. Gut. Schauen wir mal, was hinten los ist. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. Feuerlöscher inspizieren. Fangen wir gleich mal beim TÜV an. I wouldn't give her a cup of coffee in the morning. Das müsste doch machbar sein, Kaffee. Jetzt hier, Suppe. Smells good. Das ist ruhig mal probieren Still können. can't believe Clive got this thing working. So much nicer than having to eat raw food all the time. Ja, vor allen Dingen bestimmte Sachen sind ohne Sitter. Ich glaube, wir hatten eine Bottle Wasser, bevor es Okay, haben Wasser abgefüllt, bevor es ausgefallen ist. Aber bei 184 Tagen, irgendwann wird das abgefüllte Wasser ja auch schlecht. Uh, es beginnt zu thin out in hier. Thank God we have a garden now. Okay, Garten, Wasser, funktionierender Herd. Hört sich doch bis hierhin gar nicht so schlecht an. Und die Waffen mussten lange nicht mehr benutzt werden. Achso, das sind die Wachhunde. Your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. It's better than the alternative. I'd rather she have a shorter, happy experience in this world than one full of fear and death and horror. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Eigentlich ist es doch nicht nötig, die zu füttern. Warum füttern die die denn? Hm. Und vor allen Dingen mit was? Tim Walker reden. Hm? Okay, da kann ich also nicht lang laufen. Eigentlich will ich nicht mit denen reden. Ach, Oma. Jetzt wieder zurück. Hier ist nichts mehr, oder? Okay, also wieder zurück. Mann, oh Mann. Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa, nicht lustig, what's nicht your lustig. Problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. 
you see it and you want to protect it and and now it's gone that sucks maybe if Clive dies next we can put him out there instead he'd make a better watchdog anyway Becca Shell, Becca something's going on outside what is it I don't know something bad we gotta find Roman ja, weiß nicht was, aber was Schlimmes passiert da draußen. Na super. Da wird hier mal eine halbwegs friedliche Folge. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop him. If so care we will. Jeez. Larg him. My God. Larg him. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Hmm. Who is he? I got no idea. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. the second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on But his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? Boyd's right. We should just let him go. Why? Look at the poor bastard. We've all done the same thing trying to survive. We don't have to be responsible for him, but we can give him some food. And let him take his own it's chances. It's not about his chances. It's about ours. What's to stop him from coming back? And armed next time. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he, he gonna... He can't help? even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. It's so racistisch, wenn er sich versteht. Ist das einfach so? We can find a way for him to help. <sighs> well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. He made us beat up that guy with a mustache and steal his boat. We did that. I've regretted it ever since. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ! Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We are letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Yeah, jetzt liegt's an mir. Lass ihn frei. We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. <laughs> Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him some food, when, three or four cans, just as a gesture of good faith, and get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying, but you better understand this. You came this close to death today, and if you ever, ever come near this place again, or tell anybody where we are, you wish you had died today. Klare Ansage, die er wahrscheinlich nicht verstanden hat.
Tag 259. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Don't let anyone else know about that spot. Just in case. In case of what? In case something happens and we need to get out of here in a hurry. We've got to always be prepared. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? Oh. I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. So I will. Irgendwas ausgehackt. How come no one's watering these? Oder wollen sie uns rausschmeißen? Wir nicht ziehen nichts, nachdem sie uns vorher in Ruhe am Karten spielen lassen. Joyce, do you know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? They caught Stephanie stealing and then trying to escape. Oh my God. What are they going to do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Stefanie hat gestohlen. Nee, wir bringen doch niemanden um. Wir haben einen Fremden nicht umgebracht, der versucht hat zu klauen. Da werden wir doch wohl keinen von unseren Leuten jetzt hinrichten. Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive? We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us a hundred percent. Let's talk to her first. See if we can talk some sense into her. No. When she tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo, she knew that could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance, she might not try to leave so quietly. You got your gun? 
what's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Ja, wie immer ich mich entscheide, er steht hinter mir. Aber nur bei dem, was ich sage, nicht bei dem, was ich mache, oder? Shell, what's wrong? Am I in trouble? Gerade raus. It's Auch wenn Stephanie. Ich sie schützen will. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Hmm. She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. Are you okay? Do you want to talk about it? No, I don't. I just want to get it over with. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Um. Immer eine Wahl. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. Was? Gut, nur zu? Nein. Du bist schon hart genug drauf. Ich werde es no, tun. I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. Roman's waiting. I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. Ich find's nach wie vor nicht gut. Aber wer weiß, was passiert wäre, wenn wir einfach Gas gegeben hätten. Überleben ist dann an der Stelle vielleicht doch mal wichtiger. I'm sorry. Me too. Natürlich auch noch ihn erschießen können jetzt. Oh, das wäre dann am Ende auch nicht besser gewesen, oder? Lasst mich gerne auch mal eure Meinung zu diesem Dilemma in den Kommentaren wissen. Wenn ihr mögt. Sehr gnädig, dass man uns diese Sequenz erspart hat. Gut, das war äh, die Geschichte zu äh, Shell. Ja, und dann beim nächsten Mal führen wir uns dann noch die Geschichte von... Bonnie zu Gemüte. Und wer das nicht verpassen wollte, dann abonniert doch gerne den Kanal und klingelt das Glöckchen, damit ihr eine Push-Benachrichtigung bekommt, wenn es soweit ist. Ein Zweiten bedanke ich mich recht herzlich für eure Aufmerksamkeit und sage bis zum nächsten Mal. Auf Wiedersehen.